I just received my February mystery box from the Pokepower Company. I'm receiving one of these boxes free every month because you all helped me win their unboxing competition. Once we're in the box, we're met with this list of everything inside and an ad for this month's raffle prize. Even if we don't win it, that's okay because the Beedrill sticker will suffice. Next, we have 10 packs, and I hate to spoil things, but these packs were not super fruitful, though we did get this awesome Rainbow Shaman. The makers of the box don't put the cards in the pack, so I can't judge them for that, but I can for all of the extras they put inside. First, we get this Ultra Beast card, which is pretty cool because I wasn't playing or collecting at the time of its release, so it's something new for sure. Next is a Japanese Crobat V, one of the first cards I fell in love with when I began playing the game again, and a cute vintage Japanese fan fee to boot. Finally is the first ever graded slab I've gotten in one of these boxes. It's this 7.5 Nidorino from the Fire Red and Leaf Green expansion. Nidorino isn't a lot of people's favorite Pokemon, but I love this era of cards just so much, and that's why I'm so glad 